who won and who came close? Well, uh, Dan Bishop uh, on the Republican side, who's a state senator from Mecklenburg County, won uh, pretty easily. He almost got 50% of the vote. He got 48% of the vote. Uh, there were other candidates involved. Uh, Stoney Rushing from Union County, a commissioner there, rather controversial figure, rather larger than life. He ran. He had a boss hog ad at one point out there. <laughs> uh, Matthew Ridenauer, Mecklenburg County commissioner, was in there as well as Lee Brown, a realtor who ran the Realtors Association Political Action Committee and got a lot of money from that Political Action Committee. Um, and those were the, the big ones. Uh, and Bishop got half the vote. Um, um, it wasn't expected, got, really, that uh, anyone was going to pull that kind of number with uh, quite a few people in the field. A lot of people thought that uh, that Dan Bishop would hit the 30% threshold necessary to avoid runoff. I wasn't one of them. I thought uh, Ridenauer was running a very very public campaign. He was re you know he was he was really active. Uh, the uh, the rushing of course got the endorsement of the discredited uh, Reverend Mark Harris who pulled out of the race after the, all the shenanigans were uncovered. And uh, Lee Brown had a ton of money in that race. And so I thought it, that it, they would hit, at least get enough support to prevent uh, Bishop from hitting that figure. But no, he got almost, he got 48% of the vote. Very few votes cast, only about 10% turnout. According to the State Board of Elections, there were about 313,000 voters who were eligible to vote in that primary between Republicans and unaffiliated, and only about 31,000 cast ballots.